spooky spot, we're having a look at the new 2013 McDonald's Halloween Pails. For the boys, they have the Angry Birds Star Wars Pails. And certainly for the girls, we've got ourselves Monster High. Now there are th going to be three available. They're starting to circulate now in most McDonald's restaurants. There are three available of both the Star Wars and Monster High. Spot's probably not going to do a review of all three as they come out every single week, but I just want to show you the new pails that are available at McDonald's. First, starting a look at the, the Angry Birds Star Wars. Kind of got a nice little image. I, I assume this is the first pail, the first of the three. It's a red-handled pail, and then we've got Luke Skywalker going on there, Yoda on the side, all in Angry Birds form, and on the other side, we've got Darth Vader, Vader Pig, and then we've got these Stormtroopers on the side there as well. In both cases, in both cases, you get yourself some stickers, which I had to also mention to the fine gentleman that was uh, serving me at the McDonald's. I had to remind him that the stickers were also had to be included, and he's like, oh, right, yeah, stickers. Yeah, right, the stickers. Anyways, <laughs> needless to say, there is actually a section here, right up underneath Star Wars, where it looks like you can take one of the labels and you can put the label on and write your name. So if, for example, you have a couple different kids in the household or you're going to school and you have some of your pails, you can write your name on it, Jedi Knight. Ooh, Jedi Knight Spot, that has a good good sound to it. Um, but you can take the, write your name on there, and then you know right away it's your pail. Uh, it is, from what I can imagine, the exact same size pail as we've gotten every single year, even the Scooby-Doo ones that we had the previous year, and the normal spooky pails. Um, but yeah, I like the uh, I like the Angry Birds quite a bit. The only thing I really don't care for is, uh, normally, I kind of like when they give you stickers that you can interact with the pails themselves. I'm happy that they give us stickers, but it doesn't seem like any one of these stickers you can really do anything with on the pails themselves. Uh, in the past, we've gotten Scooby-Doo, where you can actually design Scooby-Doo using, um, you know, disguised pieces like a nose, you know, eyes, eyebrows, and stuff like that. With the Angry Birds, you're pretty much just getting a whole bunch of random stickers. You got like the X-Wing going on there, you got some Jawas, you got R2-D2, some TNT. But really none of which I would imagine you can really put on the pail. Uh, I suppose, if anything, you could probably take one of the lightsabers, like so, and you could kind of just put the lightsaber in Luke's hand, so to speak. But I thought that's about the only thing that's really disappointing is the fact that you can't really do too much with these stickers. On the back, however, you got fellow Jedi. Use the stickers on the lid to customize your scene on your pail. But again... You can't really customize all that much to something that's already kind of done. Perhaps, maybe, if anything. Well, see, even if you were to take the the TIE Fighter, it looks like the TIE Fighter and TIE Fighter Advance here, even if you were to put them on the pail, you could maybe put them here, but they don't give you, like, a trench scene or anything like that that you could really use on the pail itself. So, still a bit disappointing. There's still a section that you can put your your hand or your child's hand into and you can carry the pail around. I know, I know, it's never enough. This is too small of a pail to hold the amount of candy that you really need to keep in there, but needless to say. I gotta almost say that between the two, I think the Monster High is a little more going on. The handle still has a section for a child's hand to easily fit. Got Monster High on the top there. Now, with unlike uh, Star Wars, the Angry Birds Star Wars, the stickers that came with the Monster High seem to actually do a little bit more. Um, there are sections on the Monster High here where you can take things such as, like, the bat. By the way, there's the sticker sheet right there. You can take, like, the bat, and you can put it, not really, maybe not really the easiest, but you can stick it on areas but at least here, you can do something. You can put the sticker on the side of the the, uh, the bucket, the pail. Um, also, there is the section this pail belongs to. And I don't really see a section on the actual handle. So I would imagine, if anything, you would kind of have to put it, you know, maybe on the pail itself, maybe on the side, something like that. And you'd be able to write the child's name in. Um, on the front, though, this is Frankie Stein. 
A cute name for a devilish little monster girl, Frankie Stein. She's doing the bat to see, although really she's missing her the rest of the arm. I assume it's not her arm, it's some poor unfortunate soul, but uh, I think that's neat. You know what, it might even be her arm because it's stitched there. But sticker-wise, I think you're getting a little bit more in the way of stickers than what you would with the Angry Birds. And then on the back there, use your stickers to make your pail scary cute. Pick a special spot for each sticker, peel and stick. Make your own, make yours with your, uh, well, make it yours with the name label, like so. And then you can see that they've just written in, apparently Rebecca owns this pail. Um, again, you're going to get three pails. Spot's only really going to be looking at the first lot of pails this time around. But uh, I like the I like the Monster High. Kind of wish the Angry Birds Star Wars could have done a little bit more than what was going on. I like the designs on the on the bear, on the uh, pail. I just wish you could do more with the stickers. That's all. Today's spooky spot. We're having a look at the new McDonald's 2013 Halloween pails. Monster High is cool. Star Wars, it's all right. I would probably, if, if anything, just not use the stickers. If anything, you could use the, probably the stickers and just put it on your binder. Or decorate, I'd say decorate your, your brother's arm, but he probably wouldn't like that. I don't think mom and dad would like that either. Certainly stick around, guys. Spots got more spooky spots heading your way. And as always, I'll see you next time. Woo!